here I thought I'd try to unexplain the mysteries of these two boom boxes, the 880 and the uh, Big Ben. There we go. All right, there's the 880. And uh, here's the Big Ben. <coughs> Same size, just a little bit like that. And for those of you who've never seen the inside of one, here is Oops. Here's the inside of the 880 right there. Okay. And this one here is uh, no longer am I in a hunt for trying to find the woofers for this right here because these are just tore up and they're too hard to get rebuilt because they're made out of paper and they're flat. Uh, just a paper uh, edge, whatever. I'm not going to try to repair these. I thought I would show you that to you. Okay. Then, just so you know what the, here's the back of it. All right. Hope this shows up rather well, maybe. Yeah, there we go. Hold it up in the air. Okay. So that's what the back of it looks like. And then, here is the uh, guts of the, this one here. There's that and the amplifier and, okay. So I'm gonna put this back together into the, this is the Sanyo I'm holding right here. I'm gonna put this back into the Sanyo there. This one is the good one. This is the one that works, but has bad speakers. But the other one has good speakers, but has a bad power switch. This one does, and it has a uh, like cassette deck. Don't work. That's just a belt. Okay. So I just wanted to show you that this one's deeper than the M80, and the reason why I have these two together is because they have a center woofer. Although this one's not powered, but these speakers are more easily rebuildable than the Sanyo is. Okay. So that's all I want to let you know. But have a good day. Bye.